Okay. So this is when they are discovering everything. I like that. That we get to see some of this as well. Found something, sir. They're like, how many people did he kill? Imagine listening you know, to all of this. Why did you scatter the bombs around? Good question, actually. I just kind of panicked at that point. We saw it in the previous episode. Why scatter the bones around the entire yard? I think I just wanted him to still be around. Really? Is that why? Did you think that deeply about it? I do think I was born like this. You do? I'm not so sure about that. This is like an eternal debate. Maybe we'll get the answer one day. I love that we're getting this insight. So as you were cutting your victims up, was oh. it sexually arousing for you? It seemed that way. Oh yeah. That was pretty clear. That is what turned him on. You know, there's a term for what you're describing. Nothing did it, except for that. Oh, really? Human beings. Wow. Men in particular, we tend People to are so... Like our I don't know. Shiny. Strange? I don't know if fascinating is the correct word right now, but in some ways, it is. Could be that wetness with regards to the vagina is a signal of a woman's readiness for sex. We could very well be hardwired for it. Maybe. Okay. Everyone smile. He actually smiled. Is there a real photo? I would love to see that. What the fuck? How did he get in there? I don't know. Wow! What the hell? That was so smooth. He just walked in and no one noticed. Like, what the hell, guys? They were all too focused on the camera. Oh. I see. Well, that was smart as well. Oh my god, that is rage. What the heck's going on here? What's the excuse now? Let's hear it. Hi, Jeff. The father is so she disappointed. Went. I don't know. She left. Where'd she go? I don't know. That's the problem. She didn't tell me. She went looking for aliens, I think. UFOs. It's always been the same with her. Man, he didn't even know. And here she's leaving an 18 year old boy alone in the house. This family, I don't know. That is also part of the problem, I believe. We have to figure out. Oh, we're gonna get your life in order, okay? All right. I like that he's trying, but maybe it's too late. Should have checked in a bit sooner, don't you think? Well, you managed to graduate. That's uh, that's an accomplishment. Tried to fake some stuff as well, to impress on you, maybe. Well, what about community college? Community college. That's like for failures. Well, I mean, that might be where we're at. Exactly. Just deal with it. Why am I trying to coach him? Why am I trying to pretend to be something I'm not? Does this have a deeper meaning? He's like, yeah, I'm just gonna embrace it now. My darkness. All of it. I'm yeah, not a good I'm boy. A normal guy. We're gonna see. I don't fit in. I'm weird. I don't. Papa, I don't think you understand. And there's stuff that I've done that I, uh... That we can't really talk about. I think I should tell you about. He didn't confess, right? I don't remember that. Reading about it. I just got an idea. <laughs> just, um, we almost got there. No, it was so close. Maybe he would have confessed. We're gonna get him in Ohio State. We are. We're gonna get you into uh, Ohio State. He's like, I don't care about that. Maybe his father should have listened a bit more. I don't know. I honestly am clueless. All the money we get you to come here, and now I got a call from the dean. What's this about now? Uh, I'm just gonna cut to the chase. Is Jeff going to class? No. What the hell? He has no self-discipline. We're gonna get those grades up. <laughs> Mr. Thelma, you don't understand. This might be... Jeff has been oh, expelled. I was like, this might be too late. It is too late. He has been expelled. You're going in the fucking army. Wow, that escalated quickly. But all right, you were talking about discipline. Maybe that is what he needed. Oh, well, look at that. Look at that. He looks a bit different. He's even smiling. Maybe that was good for him. Well, I, I trained to be a medical specialist. Medical spe specialist? Okay. I bet he loved that. Which one was it again? What was the name? Halcyon. We get great results. Very effective. This is the stuff he is into. You could see his enthusiasm. What they don't know is that they are making him even more dangerous. He found it. Found what he was looking for. Now we're back to this. Being awkward. Guys are real nice. You were partying? Wait, what the hell are you doing? Surely he didn't kill people back there. But he couldn't have killed anyone. What am I watching? Stop! Hey! Get your 
your ass out of the car. Now. Like, what is it now? He quit or what? You flunked out of college and you got kicked out of the army. Okay, so he got kicked out of the army. Man, the father is about to lose it. I bet he just wants to cut him off, but he can't. Because it is his son. Part of having unconditional love for someone. He's always up to something. What's in this box? Oh, those are photos of your father. You want to take a look? Yeah, I'm interested. Got a screw loose up here or something. Makes me wonder again. Was this inevitable? I think you just need to find a nice girl, is all. I want to believe that something could have been done. I think you should that grandma is so sweet. He's like, I can't. Nah. It ain't for me. I've done too much of the dark arts. And I think if you came back to church, it would help you understand and resist those Or achieve the opposite of that. Just add an, another element of darkness to it all. Here we go with the meat again. This is super difficult to relate to. I am butcher. I am learning in, in Poland from my father. Oh, let's go. Just leave the sheets outside oh. the door. Kind of like to make my own bed. So that is the moment. I like that we're going back to it. I wanted to see how this went. Don't tease us. Yeah, this is what I want. How will the confrontation go? Do you have, you know, feelings for... Uh, I don't know what I'm talking about that. Because if you did, we could go to church and pray about it because the Lord Jesus Christ can do a miracle. Where is my fucking... Oh, no. He is snappy. This is the first time I see him snap like that. Look at him. Face of the devil. Don't do anything to grandma. She was quick with throwing it away. Granny, call papa. You saw it. He's dangerous right now. Really sorry, grandma. Okay. Interesting. So, grandma, do you accept the apology? Well, I accept your apology. But I don't Perfect. Like yeah. That is where I, where I draw the line. Never curse at me again. You know what? The state fair is coming up. Okay. They got a beer temple. A He's like, what? What did you say? Let's go then. No, no, no. This is getting too trippy for me. Are you kidding me? Jeff, what the hell? No, Jeff, I heard what happened at the state fair. I can't have you. The news spread quickly. We have principles here. If you want to represent us, you better behave. He might actually be a little overqualified for this position. Is that so? All right. Well, he got it. I do this all the time. Hmm. He's like, why are you telling me this? Right. And don't look at me like that, please. Wait, what? Why the hell would you take that home? I don't think I should ask questions like that. Have you ever looked at yourself like that? I have never been as passionate about it. What are you going to do? Smear it all over you? Drink it! We have a va vampire in the building. First step to becoming a cannibal. Yuck. What is this? Transylvania? Dracula? He's really enjoying this. Hello, boys. Want to have a good time? I said good luck. It's impossible to get his attention. Is that so? Well, maybe I can get your attention. And you're here alone then? Well, let's, let's go do something. No, and this is where we say goodbye. Thanks for today. Hey, Ricky. Hey, large room. Someone probably has to die in every episode. Alright. Thank you very much. Why was I looking straight at it? I don't know. Human curiosity? Let's blame it on that. My man has been starving. Jeff is more sensual about it. This dynamic is interesting. Alright. This time it ain't a mannequin. We're getting the real deal. Where are you going? We missed all the action. Now he's the one who's in charge. You're becoming a regular. That's how it is. Give me a discount next time. Give us some drinks first. Oh no. What will he do to the drink? Yep, of course. What if he did a mistake and drank from the wrong one? Okay. Of course, something like this would happen. You ain't welcome here anymore. Get the fuck out of here. 
You should run away from this guy right now. He brings guys in here and he drugs them. Yeah, expose him. You're blacklisted. Get the fuck out of my bathhouse. The police should have done something about that already. Get the fuck out of here. I didn't do anything. You fucking idiot. So me. Do it. Call the cops. I don't believe in God. Okay. That provoked her. She's triggered. She will plant that handbag in your face if you're not careful. Denying the Heavenly Father? How dare you? This dude has some moves. I like that. Some nice music. Totally my vibes. The huge. Killer dance moves. Maybe you can teach me. Really? That was a bit too much. Come on. Feel the music. Without the killing, this would have been so fun. Just vibing to some music. Oh, it's my treat. Why can't we just stay in a bathhouse? I'm banned. Sorry to tell you. More dancing. Can't get enough. Poor people. They just want to have fun. Come across a cycle like this. What the hell? What are you doing? Preparing some drinks. Please, my man, don't drink it. But how would you have known? It was the wrong one. Is that what happened? I think so. You screwed up. Just go to sleep, Jeff. Pass out, please. No. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Fall over. Drop the glass. Don't, don't, don't. He always finds a way. 69? Or what? Why are you guys sleeping like this? What? Wait, what? What is up with his hand? He is all bruised up. Kidding me? He killed him. But how did you get away? Once again. This is just unbelievable. How many times am I going to say that? Nah. It's too late. Wow. This is crazy. Freaking Jeffrey. So that is what he did. Of course. You actually managed to fit him in there? Push it down. Of course. I was like, you better be quick. Why the hell would I say that? And there she goes. Now what's in that box? I don't want to see a head or any organs. Wait, what? Nah, I'm gonna have nightmares. I don't know. I think this is the most disturbing thing I've ever seen. At least on this channel. And we've seen quite a lot now. I'm all cold now. He really did put a head, head in the box. That was super chilling. This was maybe the most insightful episode, certainly when it comes to witnessing Jeffrey's lifestyle and struggles in life. Jeff had no self-discipline and he could not control his impulses. He gave in to his darkest urges and I probably shouldn't call him Jeff. I'm just doing it ironically. Now, the question is always, could something have stopped it from escalating to this point? And that is the million dollar question. Anyway, he's just getting crazier and braver and he's already committed some smaller crimes. He did kinda get away with a lot of stuff but also no one ever expects someone to be a murderer he wears his good boy appearance as a disguise that was probably his ultimate weapon in the end even his father had enough of him i feel bad for the grandma having to deal with him why have they given her this responsibility what annoys me most about the father is that he always escapes the situation dude your money is not the solution your attention might have been i'm not sure but maybe it could have helped. And let's not talk about Jeffrey's mom. Do not underestimate the importance of having a good relationship with your mother. The opposite has the power to create a killer. Let's leave it at that for now. Jeff passing out would have been my favorite scene, but it never happened. Instead, it became a scene that I want to forget. So as my favorite, I'm gonna go with that spa man confronting Jeffrey. The only thing that was missing was a hard slap. Now, I'm gonna give this episode an 8 out of 10. Actually, it might have been my favorite episode. I found it interesting learning more about his life. At this point, he is officially a dark lord. And I guess that's that. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for being a watcher. This channel is proudly powered by Patreon. If you'd like to get a little bit of extra content, uncut watch-alongs, exclusive reactions, or if you simply want to see everything before everyone else does, then for the price of a drink, you can unlock it all. Follow the link in the description for more information. And most importantly, thank you for the support.